What's up guys, welcome back. This is Nick up here at Maple Motors in Hendersonville, Tennessee. And today we're going for a test drive in a 1968 Camaro. This one here has a crate 570, which is 350. Power steering, upgraded pulley, aluminum radiator. And we're gonna be taking off down the road here. Point out any kind of flaws that I can find. That way you know exactly what you're buying when you get here. This one's got four wheel disc brakes all the way around, a set of coys. Dual exhaust out the back. Check out maplemotors.com for financing, shipping information, wheels, tires, parts, and accessories. All right, guys, we're getting ready to hit the road. Join us on Snapchat, Instagram, and TikTok. It's that time. Let's go for a ride. Looking around on the interior before we take off here, the dash pad's in pretty good shape. We are missing a rear view mirror and needs a headliner pretty bad. I'm really liking the seats that they put in here though. They did a good job on that. They're nice, the package tray looks good and the panels are pretty in pretty good shape. Look at these seats though, they're awesome. Got a console here and somebody added cup holders right here it's almost it's kind of inconvenient because you got to grab the shifter like this but i'll show you here in a moment starting it up here go ahead and place your vets do you think the horn works on this one all our gauges are coming up here looks like our oil pressure or our tip gauge is starting to come up and our voltmeter is working we do have the face to the radio in the inside of the office here blower motor is working i heard it cut on and horn no it's even got the spring in it. Wipers. I think our wipers are gonna need some work too. All right, guys. Let me show you the mileage before we take off here. Can't stand by, that's a 68 model. Let's hit the road. All right, guys, getting ready to take off down the road here. Anything that I see, I will point out. I did notice there's no seat belts on this side. There is on the passenger side. So it will need some seat belts. Brakes are nice and touchy. Let's go down the side of the road here. All right. pretty strong on this one this car is pulling to the left pretty significantly got a nice pull there speedometer's coming up but we're not running 60 right now we're running about 45 the brakes feel awesome you hear that fuel pump in the trunk there does get up and go I don't think the kick down is hooked up if you hook that up definitely shift down and take off here I'll slip it out into neutral I'm going from second to third but it's nice it's kind of loose there so turn signals are popping up on the dash here on both sides the mirrors are a bit off Need to adjust them. Gotta love a Camaro, man. It's one of my favorite Chevrolets from this year for sure. Suspension's not too bad. pulling this parking lot here go ahead and get some outside shots drive by the camera get a full description walk around video uh it's two separate videos for every car so if you're just first time seeing this channel every car that you see has a second video one's a test drive and one is a walk around so definitely be looking for that walk around it gives you uh inside outside shots underneath everything all right i'm gonna drive over this camera 
see what kind of footage we can get. guys so i was circling around the parking lot here and i noticed the temperature gauge got up to about 215 220 shut the motor off uh opened the hood found out the electric fan was not hooked up plugged it in like your fans back on should cool it off that was the only fan we had so give her a second to cool back down and uh we take off here just figured i'd let y'all know that's what i found I mean, I didn't even, there was no evidence of it even overheating unless I looked down and seen the gauge. I was like, okay, we're getting a little hot. What's the problem here? And then I noticed the electric fan was not cutting on. I was like, okay, that's the only issue we got, so. Ooh, she wants to burn out though. You get into that throttle, it'll start kicking them tires over. That's for sure. See, we're already back down to uh, 200 on the gauge. For it to get that hot with no fan i was circling the parking lot passing the camera i did a full walk around video i want y'all to check that out we're back down to 190 now oil pressure is about 35. when you give it throttle it goes up to almost 60. hit the ground or something there it was a big bump in the road you got a big bump in the road here check the suspension a little stiff car has been lowered pretty good all right we've made it back to the lot I'm gonna grab another car I'm gonna try to be on a roll today and knock out 10 videos so let's see what we can do I'll go ahead and show you these vitals
right, guys. I do appreciate you riding along with me. Hopefully it helped you out. Let you know everything about this car. Watch both videos. You can find the other one in the last 30 seconds of this one. Check out maplemotors.com, 100 detailed pictures, financing, shipping information, and all of our inventory will be located on that page with pricing. If it's available still, it'll have a price on it. All right, guys. I'm going to grab another car. Tons to do today. Appreciate y'all watching. Thanks again.